Well, what is freedom? Freedom is not, I can tell you this, is not the right to do what we please irrespective of what others think or feel or suffer. How do you get freedom? It's interesting to hear young people say, I ask them occasionally, some think you get freedom with wealth or health or power or education. Do these things bring freedom? In a real sense, each of them contributes heavily. Education frees us from ignorance if we're really educated. Education frees us from superstition if we really are educated. Health frees us from the burdens of sickness and sorrow in that respect. Power and freedom free us themselves in their influential sense from the negations of the human personality which makes some less important in the eyes of their fellow men than others. Wealth, health, do these things free a man, power and education? While each may contribute, they are not freedom. Let me say to you in the few minutes I have left that if I know anything in this world, it's this, that freedom is what Jesus said it was, the opposite of slavery to sin. In the eighth chapter of John about ye shall know the truth and the truth shall make you free. The Savior says that men who are servants to sin are the opposite of freedom. I'm talking about national and personal freedom, and I suggested that the basis of them is the same. Righteousness and integrity, a high moral plane of community and personal conduct. Do you think that wealth brings freedom? Within the last month, I have entertained at least six or seven people on Temple Square who come to see us, learn a little bit about us, and who have then come back after a short tour to talk about the gospel and what it meant. A wonderful family from Texas, wealthy, multimillionaires, really, who've spent their lives accumulating and spending and kind of manipulating their wealth, and who'd spend one hour listening to a simple, humble guide tell the story of the restoration of the gospel and who then come back and say to me, we've spent 50 years without any real goal. Tell me, really, will you? And they lean across the table. Tell me, what is it we feel here? Is it this man? Is it the story he tells? Is it this place? And they bear testimony that they feel a freedom they've never known in all their lives. 